And then do I say my name or? Okay. 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 Yep. Hi, I'm Harriet Cole. I'm a lifestyle expert and the creator of Sense and Sensitivity, a nationally syndicated advice column. I am here today so excited to talk about Good Neighbor Day. Guess what? It was created way back in 1978 by President Jimmy Carter. He was a visionary man. He understood the importance of having us choose to make good relationships between each other at a time when our country was a little bit rocky. Well, fast forward to today, we still need to make that choice to be kind to each other, to treat each other with respect. But are we doing it? That's the big question. Well, State Farm conducted a survey to figure out what, where are we on this grid of whether or not a, being a good neighbor is important. Guess what happened? We learned that most of us believe that all those values that our parents and grandparents had, you know, about speaking kindly to neighbors, about having each other's back, even about wanting to socialize with each other, all of that remains important. The big divide is that many of us aren't doing anything about it. We want somebody else to organize the party. We want somebody else to take the first step. But Good Neighbor Day is about telling us we need to take that first step. And it's not even difficult. When you're walking outside your house, you close the door and turn the key before you rush off to your activity. Turn left, turn right, look ahead of you. Do you see a neighbor? Reach out and wave your hand and say hello. Make eye to eye contact. Literally speak to them. It doesn't have to be a half hour conversation. It just needs to be you sharing that heart to heart joy that says it matters to me that you're next door to me. And by the way, let your neighbors know that you are there for them so that they don't need to go across town to get that proverbial cup of sugar if they're making pie. You let them know that you're here to help. You can send a little note, you can write a little note, put your name and address and phone number, slip it under the door when you see a new neighbor come and you don't have an opportunity to go say hello to them right away. What you want to do is let people know that you want to connect with them. And here's a great thing out of that survey that I loved. Did you know that men are actually the ones more likely to organize the party than women? I love knowing that. I told my husband, you can do it, honey, and we'll help you. We all want to go to that neighborhood party, whether it is in the summer, it's welcome, welcoming the fall, it's the holiday gathering. We all want to go. Somebody needs to organize it. That could be you. You want to be a good neighbor. I know you do. I want to. So smile, say hello, connect with the people around you, and then notice how much brighter your day can be. If you want to learn more about this study or more about what you can do to be a good neighbor, go to statefarm.com backslash neighbors. Happy Good Neighbor Day.